guys, so I thought that I would do another tea time video, but this time I'm not drinking hot tea, I'm drinking iced tea. I like tea time videos because I feel like I can get off topic and it doesn't really matter. I can just talk to you guys. I hope you guys like the way I'm filming again because this is the way I filmed in my haul. I lost my phone. I lost my whole purse when I went to the mall. I don't know if someone stole it or we had to go somewhere after that and I don't know if I left it in the car and someone stole it. I really don't know what happened, but luckily only... My, like six dollars were in it, my phone was in it, and it was in a purse, and that was it. Because if there was more money in that, there's no way of getting that back. But my phone, like earlier today, I went and I deactivated my phone and got a new one, or I'm getting a new one. I got like the Sims card for a new one. I'm upset not just because I lost my phone, but because I lost that purse. That was my favorite purse, and I can never get that purse again because it was actually pretty old. It was my mom's purse, and I just took it. And um, I only wear it like so often because it's like a tan color and I never even got to show it in a video That's why I'm upset because I wanted to make a purse video and I wanted to put it in and I can't put that one in And then my other favorite purse broke when I went to the movie So I really always want to sit down and film a video, but I just don't have the time Also because my iMovie doesn't work so I can't just oh I want to film a bunch of videos because I don't really have time to like import the videos onto my computer and then send them either to my sister or my dad so they can be uploaded. Well, I'm usually importing my clips to my computer and then I have to sign on to iChat, run downstairs, I sign on to my account on my dad's iChat on his computer and then I, I go back up here, send all the clips, go back down there, um, accept all the clips, go back up and like make sure it all worked, go back down, wait for it to load. After it loads, I go back up and sign out. Then I go back down and put them all to iPhoto and then put them all to iMovie and then edit and this is just a, such a long process for me to do so this is just why there haven't been a lot of videos, but I really wish there were more. I really wanted to say that I'm a huge fan of The Hunger Games. I actually read that in 8th grade. I'm in, I'm a freshman. I'm in um, ninth grade right now. I read it last year. It was before I even knew that a movie was coming out. Um, I know a lot of people just read it because they're like, a movie, I'm going to read the book first. But I just read it. So after I read The Hunger Games in 8th grade, like after I finished, it was... I remember it was close to spring break because I remember I went on vacation and while I was on vacation someone mentioned that they're making a movie for it and that was 2011 and it was spring break last year. I was like, oh I want to look up when it's coming out and I was like, 2012, wow, like I have to wait so long for this. And then it finally came out and I was like, I'm so excited, I'm going to see it. Um, I didn't go opening night, I just went like a week later or something. And I saw it and I really liked it and I was like, right after that I was like, I'm reading the second book. So I read the first one in 8th grade and I don't even remember everything that happened. So I know that they took out a few things in the movie, but I don't remember every specific detail of The Hunger Games, the first book. I ended up reading the second book. Right after I saw the movie, I was like, tomorrow I'm going out and buying this Mockingjay and Catching Fire, or Catching Fire and Mockingjay. I read the first one in 8th grade and then like almost pretty much like a year later I read the second one. So it's kind of weird, but I still like remembered stuff. And also the movie kind of helped, even though it was a little different. I just finished Catching Fire. When you're seeing this, I didn't just finish. I finished like kind of a little bit like a while back. The last, I don't know if it was just me, but if you guys read this, did the last like chapter or like last six pages confuse any of you? I did read it like five times. I didn't, me and my sister both read it and we're both like, that was so confusing. So I don't know if it was just me. I did really like it and I definitely recommend it. And I have Mockingjay. Actually, I have it right here. I'm so excited to read it. I heard that the last one is not as good but I'm definitely gonna read it. I definitely think you should read the book and then see the movie. Uh, my sister she started reading The Hunger Games and then she saw the movie and then finished the book and I think that that was like kind of funny. I wanted to talk about this lookbook thing. What I was thinking is I would do a different outfit and every outfit would be in a different location so my first outfit would be like a cute like cover-up look um, with a bathing suit and a cover-up or like a cute outfit like on the beach and then the next one like I would like, snap my fingers or like turn around you know something cool and I would be outside playing basketball or something so I do like a cute comfortable outfit for just being outside on a sunny day then I would like do something like jump and then I would jump into a, a different place I think it would be so cool and I'm really excited I really want to do that so if you guys want to comment about like where to film it can be inside it can be outside it can be anywhere um then let me know, like, even if it's just, like, a lake and you guys don't know if there's a lake near me, I can always just film it, like, in, in like, a blank area. If you think you are going to be going somewhere this summer or, like, like soon and you want to know a look for it, 
just let me know because I'll find a way to film it for you like even if it's just like on a blank wall just let me know like different places because maybe I haven't thought of one if you want to email me anytime feel free to I love talking to people and definitely let me know if you guys like these or not it won't hurt my feelings if you don't I'll see you guys next time bye People on bikes. And pouring cup in this, pouring cup in this 